Welcome to the A Canada Travel video training series. Today we are going to discuss content marketing. As always, first things first is in order to do any type of interaction with the A Canada Travel website, friends, likes, groups, comments, reviews, we need to log in. So the login button is in the top right corner. Click on that. Then you come up with your login. Once you've punched in your username and your password, you come into what's called the travel community screen, which is basically sort of like a home base for everybody. What you want to do is you want to go to up at the top right corner is your My Profile. This is always available to you once you've signed in, and it's like your control center, your home base, your camp, your everything. This is where you'll basically be able to do anything and everything from the website is from your profile. So I'm going to click on that. From my profile, and you can go, you see this bar here. This is one of the interaction bars that you're able to access to start contributing and interacting and promoting your business blog photography. Right here, as you can see where my cursor is, is Add Site Content. Click on that. These are what's called the Add Website Content, and there's a lot of different variables. You can add a community. If we don't have the community, you want to add your community. You can do parks, events, travel tips, video, photos, add trail, add travel stories, historic sites, sightseeing site, beaches, waterfalls, and we will be continually adding during the year a whole bunch of new and exciting website content, and some of it is very, very groundbreaking. But for today's purposes, let's do something like travel tips. And I've already, if you put in, you click on add travel tips. And what happens is you come up with what's called the form or input form. And on this form, it's very, very simple. You fill in what you want your travel tip to be, your category, which is already done, so you don't need to do that. You have a 3,000 character input, so it's a very short, and you select your main picture. On other types of content marketing you might have an option to put six pictures you might have an option to put a short description your address you might be able to be able to pick groups so if it's something that applies to a community a regional national provincial section you're able to do that but in this scenario we're going to talk about travel tips because travel tips are very very popular with the public and it's a great way of marketing your business and another thing is that it's so easy to do there's only a very small amount of information you need to put so like always, what we suggest is you write the information in some other program, notepad, word, and you put it all together, you spell check, you make it right, and then you just copy and paste it in. Once you've copied and pasted it in, then you just have to click save entry, and then it pops up and you can take a review of it. As you can see with our current form, as I have cut and paste everything, and what we're going to do in this scenario is we're going to do backcountry backpacking tips. So I just make my title, it goes automatically into the travel tips. I've cut and paste my text into the text form and I've used the dots here, just the little lines here, point form. You can also put it in a paragraph, whatever form is comfortable with. But again, you have a 3,000 character. So this is a nice quick little input. And then I put in my photo and make sure you downsize the photo. It's not like 8,000 pixels by 8,000 pixels. You know, downsize it to a nice reasonable one as I use 800 by 500 pixels, which is a nice reasonable size. Once you've got all that in, you click Save Entry. Once you've clicked Save Entry, what it does for you is it pops into the page. And there you go. There's my finished product. Nice and simple travel tips. And in this case, it's backpacking travel tips. And again, contributed by whoever puts it in. Now this is the best part of content marketing. Everything you put in, especially a popular thing like travel tips or uh, hiking trails or waterfalls, beaches are popular, um, parks are popular, any of those type of content contributions, you have your business and a link to your profile. Hence the importance of having a very professional looking profile because that is the initial interaction stage of the traveler with your business. So there we are, I'm the content contributioner, if that's even the word, and again, boom, I'm advertising my business, and now I'm already searched and ready to go, so when people search for backpacking tips, I have a page that is all up, all dolled up, 
and it links to my business. So for instance, let's say if we go to say a travel tips, here it is. It's, we're probably going to stick this under the more, but right now we put it on the top bar. So travel tips, if I click on that, what happens is, and we are the first one because this is a new feature, and there you go. You got Canadian travel tips, backpack, backcountry backpacking tips, my first sentence, more info, and my photo. You can also search. Now it's set up for searches. This is also going to be put into the search engines on the internet. So Google, Yahoo, MSN, Bing. And of course, it'll start coming up for searches throughout all the search engines. That is how easy it is to create marketing for your business on here. One of the key notes I want to close with is that when you are a business, you can put up tips for anything related to your business. For instance, if you're an accommodation, it doesn't have to just be accommodations. If you have, uh, if you partner with a tour company and you're educated on that, if you have wine, if you have a restaurant, if you can be a foodie, do you have food reviews and tips? Um, if you have how to book rooms uh, tips, if you know and you're active outdoors and you go kayaking or you go hiking or you go anything, you can put those tips. The nice thing is no matter what area tips you have, it links to your profile. So you have first access to the traveler. And most importantly, travelers like to, to work with people who are experienced and knowledgeable. This is a great way to get your message across. You are knowledgeable. So if you want to put tips on communities, top five things to do in your communities, these are all different types of tips you can do. If you're a tour company, how to get ready for kayaking, what you need to do if you want to go rock climbing, um, the equipment, what sort of things should you look for, all these things. So anything you can do that is a tip form, top five, top ten, top this, community that, this applies to this area. And the nice thing is, is travel tips is a very, very popular item with the travelers out there looking to book and come to Canada. So that's it for now. Thank you for joining us. Enjoy and go out and do a lot of content marketing because with our new system, how many times you content market is based on how many ads and promotions you are creating. Hundreds of promotions, you got hundreds of pages out there linking back to your business, promoting your business as an expert and be knowledgeable. So again, thank you and enjoy content marketing.